this is going to be your daily for June 3rd to the 6th, okay? Thank you for coming to my channel. If you are new, if you're returning, thank you as well. Thank you for all your likes, comments, subscribes, and shares. Greatly appreciate it. So I'm going to go ahead and shuffle the tarot since I'm drawn to do that. Um, I won't pull the tarot yet, but I'll go ahead and shuffle while I save my little spiel. Um, let's see. If you need a personal reading for me, make sure you check out the link in the description below. Um, I'm trying to think what else. That's really the main things that I want to point out. All right, you guys already have a card coming out. Of course, I am drinking my um, me time tea. I'm um, really trying to get rid of a lot of my tea packets because I'm moving. So uh, if you are interested in that, that's also in the link in the description. Okay, so um, first we're going to go ahead and get into the energetic cards for you and your partner for June to June 3rd to the 6th water signs. And then after the energy cards, we'll get into the tarot. And that's where all the tea is going to literally come out. Tea has been spilling in these dailies. Like I'm getting a lot of people storylines in these dailies. I'm kind of happy that I'm doing these dailies because they're a lot more entertaining to me than the monthlies. Because the monthlies are like a general, very general energy. These dailies seem to be very um, specific. All right. But they're going to be like personals. So you guys will be basically being able to get like little personals throughout the month if I can keep this up, which I'm pretty sure I can handle it. All right. So prayer. Okay. So uh, water signs, you have the energy of um, big time connection in your life. Wow. Miracle at the bottom of the deck. Big time connection. Both yellow solar plexus. This is soulmate energy. Someone that you were destined to be with miracle and prayer. There's going to be some tough times with this person over this uh, these next few days, third to the sixth. Um, eventually, I see that there may be a real a relocation with this person from maybe some of you a city to a rural area. It could be from a rural area to a city, but I'm mainly reading this from someone maybe moving somewhere from the city to a smaller area. Okay. Um, I'm, <laughs> there's lemonade in this and there's lemons here in this card and I'm hearing when you when life gives you lemons yeah I might have to edit that part out but um basically I'm hearing when life gives you lemons um make lemonade so if there are some issues that you're dealing with with your partner I feel like you two will be able to make it through um I feel like with the miracle card at the bottom of the deck I get this energy of something changing abruptly so I feel like if there's an energy of well this is never going to happen we're never going to move forward they're never going to get rid of that karmic or they're never going to step it up there is going to be like this very fast changing energy and it's not going to be I don't feel like it's a tower I don't feel like it's a bad energy I feel like it's going to be more of a forward movement um in a good way all right well that's great okay nice okay twin flame relationship yes yeah, some of you are in a very strong relationship magician yin yang the thing that changes is the divine masculine part of this connection finally steps it up magician card coming out of the deck flying out of the deck this is an eight energy could be a leo for some of you aries virgo gemini leo is here twice leo is here three times technically to me some of you are dealing with someone still in a marriage they will leave their marriage um soon i'm seeing two so maybe two months from now water sign some of you are dealing with an air sign yeah temple path this is a very strong connection okay uh, i feel really though um the divine masculine is going to start to wake up to the connection or start to make changes whatever that is if they're needing to get a divorce i will say that some of them may not actually divorce their spouse it may just be um the spouse that divorces this person for a lot of you i will say that but they are preparing for that 
because they already intuitively know that they're supposed to be with another person. That's going for a lot of you. Now, if it's not a third party situation, then this just means that the divine masculine will experience some sort of, um, for some of you, it's a tower. The storm warning is coming. So there's something that is maybe revealed here. Uh, a secret or something comes to an end, something abruptly happens that that kind of forces the magician to step it up. Um, he's forced, magician in the mirror, forced to look at what he's done, good or bad. In most cases, this seems to be bad, but it's the eight, so it's turning pain into power. Um, it's something that needed to happen. 2222 master number to get into this uh, twin flame uh, relationship this person had to deal with some sort of test um, also experience some sort of awakening to get into this relationship with the divine feminine okay so that is happening that's what that miracle tends to be to me um and it is coming in as a tower for him though not for the for the one who's already ready for this relationship the one that's probably watching this tarot reading i don't think the tower is for you i think the tower is for this other person okay so we already got this we already did this deck what am i doing we're doing tarot now duh all right so we have the hermit energy Okay, so water signs, your partner could be a Virgo, um, but this is someone who is not really open to you right now. They are doing a lot of soul searching, a lot of thinking, um, and they have the high repent though, but they do want commitment, okay? Strong Taurus, earth energy coming through here. I'm getting strong earth energy here with the hermit and the uh, high repent, with this is the shaman, but this person, um, knows that they want to be in a connection with you they want to be married to you they know that there's a strong connection between you two but they're like for some reason pulling back from you so they may not be that communicated with you i feel that maybe this person is ready and they know maybe you're not okay or they feel that you're not ready i don't know what it is that's got them drawn back we'll pull and find out all right so we have the Four of Cups here. So the Four of Cups energy for the water signs. So the water signs are not really sure how they feel about this relationship either. There may be a water sign hesitating to make an offer though with the Four of Cups or they're waiting for the offer. You could be the water sign because your partner is in hermit mode. You're not gonna you know, reach out. You're waiting for them to reach out to you with the Four of Cups. So we got the Five of Pentacles. But the, what that's going to do is cause the water sign to start to feel left out in the cold or sad about the connection. We've got the Four of Cups going into the Five of Cups. So the water sign is like maybe starting to distance themselves from this connection because uh, their partner went into hermit mode. So let's see why this part, their, their partner went into hermit mode. We've got the uh, Lover's card at the bottom of the deck with all these major arcana, <laughs> hermit, shaman, um, love there is a choice between two people and I feel like this person isn't necessarily giving an ultimatum this fire sign possibly is not giving an ultimatum but they are saying or this Virgo could be or Taurus they are basically saying if there's a choice I'm not really like hit me up when you make your choice you know what I mean hit me up when you make your choice why is the hermit card here three the sun card the of pentacles some of you it's a virgo a leo uh leo virgo cusp six of swords earth sign virgo again king of pentacles so uh taurus or capricorn five of swords so i feel like eventually they will come out of this hermit energy fool card yeah they will eventually come out of this hermit energy. Some of you are dealing with an Aries or a Sagittarius or a Leo. They will come out of this hermit energy. But um, I feel like Cancer, or um, Cancer specifically, um, could be any other water sign. I feel like you're going to be feeling um, 
left out in the cold or like you're going to start feeling that there's no hope for this relationship but there is i think this person has to take some time either they have a choice to make they could have a choice to, uh between an earth sign and a fire sign so they have to make their decision if they have to make a decision between you water sign and another person they will decide to be with you why is this five of cups here Three, two, one. yeah the water sign isn't really doing much yeah, King of Cups, come clarifying the Five of Cups. That's you, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Five of Pentacles. The water sign isn't really speaking. Eight of Cups. They've maybe even, like, not walked away from the connection, but they've kind of, yeah. If the water sign has a choice, they've even decided to walk away right now because they don't want to make a choice. So I feel like what's going on here is the water sign is going to start to feel a little left out in the cold um, throughout these couple of days but i feel like you shouldn't fret about that your partner is going to come out of this hermit mode i think they're trying to like figure out they're just trying to do some soul searching i think they just needed a break from the connection right now especially if there's been like this t push pull or this choice between lovers types of things going on um i think they really needed to figure out either they need to make a choice or they needed to figure out um if you really care for them if you really love them um they're doing some soul searching okay so don't fret too much this is just a couple of days okay i feel like this will work out i don't see any like death card or ten of swords so i do feel like you and this person will wind up together okay so thank you so much for watching water signs um i hope that this these messages help you please let me know if you like these dailies i'm going to continue doing them throughout june so if you want to see more make sure you subscribe and again if you need a personal reading with me make sure you check out the link in the description okay bye